This conference will now be recorded. Approval process, right? In approval process, we discussed about what was the first model, that is the jumper start with her. Okay, so we are having standard setup wizard also, right? Okay, mm -hmm. we discussed only one way, and next one is what a standard setup wizard. Okay, mm -hmm. so did you practice it, uh, Mugda and Madhu, this uh, jump start with her? Yes, but not fully. Uh... I'll go to complete my pending works. Okay. Okay. So let's see. Uh, what's this? Yeah. yeah. Approval process. A standard setup. We'll see the a standard setup. Now, how to create this standard setup also? Okay, so here in the search box, you can go for the approval process. Right. So in last time, in last time, just we return on. So which object that is account object. In account object, okay, so we discussed what was the mobile pipe. It's the same functionality, the same scenario. Okay, so we are going to see the same scenario we are going to see. So first we need to deactivate this process. So what was the process as of now we return? First we need to deactivate. Yes. So right. And then after just you can come here and select a jump start wizard. Just you can select a jump start wizard. Right. So what was the process name? That is mobile price two. Mobile price two. Right. So so when we are having any description field, obviously we have to provide some description about this one. Right, so why you are creating this approval process? Okay, so what happened? Okay, so when it is approved or rejected, or as a criteria, just to have to write a short notes on this description field. This description field, and then after just to here, next button. Right, so here, so what was the uh, criteria here? What was the criteria here? So this criteria is what entry criteria. Okay, so this criteria is not uh, necessary for us. Okay, so just you can select a, a formula values true, and here you can write the true. This is entry criteria, not the condition, not the condition, right? So then click here next. Then after see. Okay, so specify the approval field and record editability properties. See here. So who can submit? Who can sub, uh, see here? Select a field. You, field used for the automated approval automated approval is nothing but what so whenever submitting that uh, record okay it's automatically this automatically transfer to this so one more user okay so like that means what next higher authority level like that see here next automated approval determined the body who can determine who can either manager or higher edge okay so no need to select anything okay so we are going to we are going to provide manually we are going to provide manually Next, a record editability properties. What's this record editability properties? What's the meaning of record editability properties? Hmm? No idea. See here. I, I mean, uh, there is a provision for uh, editing the records. It's right. Okay, so once you submitted the approval process, who can edit my records? Once yes. you submit approval process, who can edit my record the first option is what are only administrators administrators only can edit these records right and second one is what administrators and so who is the approver of uh, this record okay so we submitted this one to the one approval now okay so that approval that is the second one right so you can select only admin can only uh, edit this record right and then after just click here next button see what was the email template 
set the notification template means what so once we assigned this uh, approval process to the any other user okay obviously we are sending one notification obviously we are sending what one notification right that notification template means what uh, so boss you are having one uh, uh, approval process from the xyz user from xyz user like that okay so here we have to provide what a notification template what is the uh, cancel see approval process request approval process request we are requesting to the approver to to what approve my recall just mm -hmm. request then click on next button right so now come here here see so when the approver approving the page so when the approver approving this one okay obviously in uh, jump start wizards we didn't get some uh, of fields okay so it shows only the standard one and then we are selecting and then mm -hmm. we are uh, selecting means approval reject but mm -hmm. here jump start wizard so what's the use of jump start wizard first of all what is the difference between a standard setup wizard and jump start wizard what is the difference between a standard setup wizard and jump start wizard see in jump start wizards we didn't get what was the history layout and all those things coming uh -huh. to the jump start wizard we are getting all those information in jump start mm -hmm. wizard we are getting all those information mm -hmm. got it right okay so let's see let's see so whatever the fields here you are selecting whatever the fields you are selecting okay so those information will be available here those information will be available here for example let's see so we are discussing on what mobile price we are discussing on what mobile price obviously uh, we have to select what was the mobile price means what so what price what price my customer want see in jump start wizard so simply we are selecting when you are submitting the record simply we are uh, providing one condition that is more than 940 dollars if it is more than 940 dollars obviously you have to submit for approval right so sorry more than 900 dollars not 940 dollars so more than 900 dollars mm -hmm. right if it is more than 900 dollars okay obviously we are going to submit uh, that record but so actually customer want what was the price okay so what price customer want so we didn't define that one mm -hmm. we didn't define that one right so but coming to here but coming to here in standard setup wizard okay so everything we are going to define means so what price this uh, uh customer what okay mm -hmm. so what price this customer wants okay so mm -hmm. that information also we are having mm -hmm. right okay so what price this customer want okay so that type of information also we are going to provide that type of information also we are going to provide see here okay so obviously i am going to add mobile price mm -hmm. what's the name who is the account owner mobile price and the next one is what what was the phone number okay so what was the rating means so this guy is eagerly uh, waiting for purchase this product or what means uh, that information so we have to provide and uh, this guy is eagerly waiting for uh, this product immediately he will pay the money okay so mm -hmm. that type of conditions okay so the manager will take the decision immediately right mm -hmm. immediately right so i want uh, these fields whenever we are whenever we are submitting the record whenever we are submitting the record i want this information got mm -hmm. it and mm -hmm. so then after just we can scroll down see so display the approve his history information in addition to the selected fields right okay so whenever okay so whenever mm, okay so whenever we submitted the record okay so not only this mobile field not mm -hmm. not only this mobile field okay mm -hmm. so any other any other fields any other fields what was the uh, fields we added like rating mobile price mm -hmm. phone number for that fields also i want to display what was the history right mm -hmm. so just we can select this one and then after a uh, security settings what is the meaning of security settings so we can access the salesforce 
we can access Salesforce in two ways. So one is through the browser, and a second one is uh, through the and through the um, exam profile tomorrow. I will share the screenshot. Identity, identity access manager. Okay, right. Okay, so yeah, security. Okay, we're having two models. So one is we can access in our Salesforce through the browser, and second one is we can access the Salesforce in through mobile device also. Mm -hmm. Right. Okay. So in which way you want to access this one? In which way you want to access this one? The Salesforce. Okay. So in mobile devices or in only the Salesforce application. Salesforce mm -hmm. application nothing but what? Like this browser. Right. Mm -hmm. The second option is what? So both the Salesforce application or externally enabled for the wireless device. Any mobile device also. Any mm -hmm. mobile device. Any mobile device also we can access better. Mm -hmm. So now I selected the first option and then after I click here next. Mm -hmm. Now you can see who is the submitters? Who is the uh, submitters? Okay, so who can submit this record? Obviously, a uh, users. So which user that is Madhu. Okay, so Madhu is my sales executive writer. So only a uh, Madhu can uh, submit this one. Only Mother can submit this one. Right. So next are the are the submit for approval button in approval process history. So why this one is already checked? So why? Because we already created one approval process in this account object now. So that's mm -hmm. why by default this approval button will be submit for approval button will be added in there. Got mm -hmm. it. Submit for approval button will be added there. Okay. And so then after I come here, so Submission settings allow submitters to recall the recall the approval request. What's the meaning of recall? What's the meaning of recall? What's the meaning of recall? The recall means what? Mm -hmm. Cancel. Okay, so for submitting this information, okay, mm -hmm. so those guys can recall this information. Just we can mm -hmm. check it. Then after click here, save. So this is the a first step. This is the mm -hmm. a first step. Right. And then after. Okay, so next. So first, as of now, submitters, we are discussing everything on submitters. So that is mm -hmm. stage one, step one. And coming to step two, approvals. We are going to discuss about us. Okay, yes, I would like to create an approval step now. So just click here, go. Just click here, go. Mm -hmm. Right. So what is the name? What is the name? So this is what? Approval process two. Right. So this is a step one. And then after click here next and then after click here next right okay so mm -hmm. here uh, what was the criteria okay so all the records should enter this step or we need to specify the criteria obviously we need to specify the criteria so what was the criteria what was the mobile price is see here what was the mobile price is okay so greater than or equals to a uh, greater than or equals to how much Nine hundred dollars. This is my condition. This is my condition. So whenever we meet this condition, whenever we meet this condition, and then only we are doing. Then click on next. Then click on next. Next here, who is the approver? Mm -hmm. Right. See here, we are having let the submitter choose the approver manually or automatically assigned to the approver. Automatically mm -hmm. assigned to the approver. So whenever here we select a second option, so to which user? To which user? We are going to select. Uh, which was mm -hmm. the model last time we selected? Steve Jobs, right? Uh, Steve Jobs, yeah. Steve Jobs, yeah. yeah. You can select Steve Jobs. Okay, and then I have to click here, save. Then I have to click here, save. Right. So, and then I have to see, so here, what was the action? Okay, I don't want to create an action now. Okay, so I want to create actions, everything on this final stage. See here. The same thing, the same thing we created in a, a jump start wizard also. The same mm -hmm. thing we created in a jump start wizard also. Right. Mm -hmm. What is the difference between standard setup and a jump start method means what in standard setup we are having some more options. We are mm -hmm. having some more options. And coming to the jump start wizard, we didn't get like that options. We didn't mm -hmm. get like that options. Right. And then after just you can scroll down. So here, what was the final approval actions? Final rejection actions and recall actions. Okay, mm -hmm. final approval action. Here I'm selecting email alert. Mm -hmm. 
this is first one so here this is approval now obviously here we have to select what was the approval yes mobile price is approved mobile price is approved right now you can click here save oh we have already this one so one two sit right so we added one action when the record was uploaded now mm -hmm. you can come here so this one is what so when the rejection right so rejection this is what one okay two two mobile price is rejected then you can scroll down set right and next third one we are having that is recall recall means what cancel mm -hmm. Three, three. Oh, well, this is what for cancel now. Mm -hmm. right so then after ultimately final step is so we have to activate this one we have to activate mm -hmm. this one. see i activated this approval process right okay so madhu now i'm giving uh, screen permissions to you but just you can check the output means you have to create one record on this uh, a particular account object just to can submit for approval yeah one minute hello yes uh... Where it is? It's not opening. In your email. Boss, first of all, you have to log into Salesforce. You have to submit yes. the records. So then only you are getting email. Okay. I didn't log in. <laughs> One minute. Okay, then what can I do? First, we have to create the record and then we can submit for approval. Create a record.
mother what i told you create the record in account object yeah, yeah one minute actually the cursor is not moving it's old app sometimes it's man you have to purchase one wireless mouse <laughs> no actually the, the port is not working that's it uh, the right side we are having close button in click on that close button if you yeah, send that one no no actually, actually some pop up cc pop up windows will be not move yeah okay close okay. that uh, no no right. yeah, actually <laughs> ah shit um. Use your laptop, uh, the mouse. So it's, the port is not working with the mouse. So, account name. Shiva, oh. what should I give here? Yeah. You can provide any account name. You can provide any account name. But mobile price should be, it's an greater than nine hundred dollars so can i give your name you can give my name or any other name okay so Mugga. so don't provide all those things right so what was the mandatory information you can provide it that's enough okay. mobile yeah. price is mandatory here mobile price is mandatory here provide okay. the mandatory greater than nine hundred dollars greater yeah. than nine hundred dollars so nine, nine, ten, or nine twenty, like that. Right. Then after click on save button. Then after click on save button. One minute, one minute. Yes. Yeah. Because we have two ranges, Madhu, right? From yes. nine between thousand yeah. to nine fifty, the sales executive can do it. And 940 and below, between 900 and that, it has to go for the approval. Click on OK. Right. So now you can log into this Steve, Steve Jobs. Just to open another browser, Internet Explorer. Oh, yeah, it's too hard. <laughs> Okay. Hey man, you have to purchase a new laptop first of all. Yeah, like, actually, <laughs> CC for for IT people, laptop is mandatory. Okay. Yes. If you don't have food or water, you can survive. But for IT people without laptop and internet internet connection, so they cannot live. Right. Not yeah, just actually. IT people now, even kids, no. So yeah, that's my main problem. Actually, previously it's working fine. Okay. Like it is working on this. So today's uh, the mobile price, electronic devices are normal. Mm -hmm. See, so before before uh, some years back, okay. So for every people want water, so for uh, for living one uh, water house, mm -hmm. okay, for eating purpose, food. Mm -hmm. These are the two uh, common mm -hmm. things. Right. Mm -hmm. So, but now in this common things, mobile also had it now. Mobile and internet. <laughs> if you have a mobile, or obviously internet is there, yeah. 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 So, oh, yes. So, okay. Yeah. Click on home. Left side we are having home is there now. Left side home. Yes. Click on home. Then you can go to the bottom of the page. The bottom of the page. Right. So submit for approval. Why it is not? Uh, why we are not getting this one? Submit for no, approval. Yeah. This is Steve Jobs Steve. only. Hmm. No, no, no. Uh, not Steve Jobs. I think so. Man, you opened your account. Madhu you, have to, you have to open a Steve Jobs account, yar. Right, you know, go ahead. So yeah. what what should I do there here? I 
No, so you it may be, right? You actually created users, right? Last week. Yes. Yeah, I forgot that one. Steve Jobs. Man, you can go and so check that. Email email email. Email, right? Yeah. We can go and check here. Yeah. Madhu Garu. Ah, just now, Ah, click on setup click on setup go to left side just you can go to users left side users click on users right as so what were the steam yeah. jobs Maybe, that's yes. it right. actually forgot this one So how can we find that uh, password? You only change that password, right? On that day. No, so yeah. Wow. No, yeah. You don't know password. You don't know okay. password. No, no, no. No. Ah, okay. So just open that uh, Steve Jobs. Click on that Steve Jobs. Not here. Only time. Only time. Click on Steve Jobs. Just click reset password. Click on reset password. Yes. Yes, just to go to that email address, Rao Sudarshan764. Yeah, yeah. Yes. That is Gmail I'm account. In. Yeah, I will check here in my mobile. Give me a minute. Actually, on that day, I didn't create that uh, password. I already told to you. See, you have to maintain your document. Right, uh, so what was the mm. training document? So what Did you downloaded? Uh, one four triple one. What you downloaded? Some uh, PDF files. Where? In browser. In Internet Explorer, right? Hmm. I didn't download it anymore. Man, man, you can you can check it. You can you can you can check it your Gmail first. Yeah. Shiva. Yeah. You know here. Uh, also, the school, my kids' school, I have two kids, right? They oh. give the laptop to the kids. <laughs> from the Very good. Like a work from home, like a work from school. Yeah, free. I mm -hmm. mean, like, you, know, you don't have to pay for that. The school gives it. Okay, so don't worry. Yeah, okay, so in, in fees, in fee, school fees, they will cover. Okay. Okay, so we need to return the laptop after completion of the what else? course means uh, one year no no because it's corona now right because of work from home school i mean the school is remote school okay nobody's going to the school building right, right? right so right. that's why that's why they gave everyone okay you didn't get any vaccine for this one in us no. uh, so from mm -hmm. saying yes i have vaccine okay so we will produce a uh, tons of lots uh, like that not yet Shiva. okay so what's the present situation is you're in chicago right i'm in miami okay oh, yeah good place mm -hmm. so first you right, get an email yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> madhu what is this madhu hey, password is wrong i forgot no. password <laughs> Don't know your password, then how can I do it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah okay, so let, me do, so many let me do one thing. Just we can just we can uh, close this box. Close this. Close this. Close this window. One minute. This one? Yes, boss. Oh, no, no. One minute. One minute. One minute. Yes, done.
Right. Uh, let's just click on setup. Hey, Rao Sudeshan 764, yeah, mail ID. You entered only Sudeshan 764. No, 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 I entered. Uh, yeah, this one only. Man, this so one is what? A username, man. This one is username. First, you have to log into your Gmail ID. So, Gmail ID is Rao Sudeshan 764. But this is uh, you are from personal lead okay for example i got your lead from any other consultancy immediately hey, this, that is username just to add rao yeah rao madhu first rao sudarshan 764 madhu email id nick email id ki username ki password are there difference delete later yeah actually i think email id Adi Adi Payanik username and Rasundi, then key made in Rasundi. Personally, personally, you got Saripag and Lepot and a consulted switch of Sunday, a mother phone is a Kudunu. Click on the two lines, so Muda, don't worry. Okay, sometimes we are uh, using a local language for easy to understand. <laughs> okay, you didn't understand, I think. No, I don't understand. Uh, Mukta, you understand Hindi? Better. Yeah, Hindi, Marathi, English, Gujarati. Oh, nice, nice. And Spanish. Okay, bit. so Mukta, oh. Mukta, whenever coming to the India, just inform to me, okay? Yeah, next year. This year I was going to come in <laughs> December, but then Corona came, right? So. Right, right. Shiva, bro, bro. Uh, Six point five six eight. Shiva, you are so smart and intelligent, right? You should apply for US, and you know you will get a nice job in Salesforce itself. Why? Why I want a job? See, why I want job? You have your business. I know that. See here. See here. Yeah. You can see here. Okay, so I have exam tomorrow morning. Mm -hmm. Not only this exam, I have a lot of exams. Is there? Yeah, yeah. I don't see your screen. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay. Sorry, sorry. So as of now, Madhu sharing screen. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sure. Uh, this is Steve Jobs. Uh, Steve Jobs. Uh, just okay. you can go here. Home. Left side we are having home is there. Uh, click on that home. Mm -hmm. Right. Just you can scroll down. Okay. See, we are having items to be approved. Okay, so why? Because in our approval yeah. process, we given we given approval process and given who is the approver that is Steve Jobs. Right, so just click on approve, click on approve. Yes, approve or reject. Right, now we can come here, see approve or reject. Click on approve. Or reject. Yes, click on approve. Right, just we can go to. Just you can go to Madhu's account. Means another browser. Yeah. Just you can go to accounts object. Accounts object. Open that Mukta account. Record. Open that Mukta record. First record. And right, then you can scroll down. This is up right uh, see so what both the ways okay so when you selected jumbo start wizard or when you selected standard setup with her okay both both the ways are same what was the function and what was the output mm -hmm. was same but what was the options you are getting so whenever whenever you're creating a approval process that is different that is different mm -hmm. got it and reminding will be the same the reminding mm -hmm. will be the same okay so this is about the approval process uh, this mm -hmm. is about what approval a process mm -hmm. got it amukta yeah. right right uh, okay next so if having any doubts wait 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 madhu sorry yeah. madhu wait yeah amukta and madhu if you're having any doubts on any topic means the previous topics means uh, both of you i think uh, so whether you're practicing or not i didn't know yeah. Okay, so you didn't ask yeah. any doubt. Still no, you didn't ask any doubt. No, 
Okay, from the starting on. We actually on have some break. doubts on uh, that. Uh, what is it? Data loader. Relationship. Uh, relationship and data loader. One uh, actually, I can practice that one. Uh, man, man, has, see, without previous... practicing how, without practicing how we are getting a doubt, sir. First of all, no, you no, said I have some actually, doubt. Uh, hmm. You said uh, I have some doubts. Yeah. Then after what I need to practice means what? So once you practice it, then only we're getting doubts, na? No, no. Actually, I'm to me and the moment practice is not from doubts, so it's not practice. So sir, recording we need in case they are not full fledged one day. కదా going through this weekend, right? so this is this is what it is like how it is broken down in the exam right shiva mm -hmm. okay yeah so what i did like uh, whatever is like like 3% 2% right this three three mm -hmm. i just mm -hmm. just group them in good to no modules i mean we have to do it but that's like less priority right i was like trying to prioritize things and mm -hmm. then then this is like on the more uh, more percentage wise so i was actually going through the course like the topics that we are going through versus this but kind of it was confusing to me i was not understanding and i was also like looking into the looking into the trailhead but then if you can just like in one liner if you can just tell me for the security and access that we did right see see we didn't touch the security and access see oh, he what are the master to know modules the first mm -hmm. one security and access we didn't touch it up and then after mm -hmm. standard and custom objects we discussed we did it. Next, we did it. Like yeah sales and marketing application like uh, what is sales and what is service that is uh, different okay next fifth one is we what we didn't do this right we didn't do this right see we we already discussed the basics what okay. is sales what is the marketing we already discussed the basics only right okay. so in depth that is a different and then so, after fifth one is what no yeah. no no shiva so in this one in the third one in the sales and marketing applications right what should yeah. i study i mean even if you like see, tell me see, see. On, so what there, should be study is nothing but what's here so mm -hmm. so here in marketing application we're mm -hmm. having one concept what that mm -hmm. concept leads concept okay so when the lead was converted automatically we are created a record on uh, accounts opportunity and uh, what uh, contacts mm -hmm. right uh, so like that you are getting the questions like mm -hmm. that you are getting the question for example i have okay opportunity is the five lakhs right mm -hmm. uh, how mm -hmm. opportunity is five lakhs means what they they will ask some scenarios here scenarios okay. based right uh, okay. okay so what are the applications we are having those applications so just we have to work on it for example we are having one uh, a field mm -hmm. like a, mm -hmm. a phone number field okay so what was the default value of the phone number okay mm -hmm. so if if one user is if one user created one lead right mm -hmm. so then what are the possibilities okay so means what we can close the leads or we can uh what are not close the leads means success or failure like that mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. so that type of scenarios they will ask yeah and then after what fifth one it's the same thing sales and marketing application and service and support application these are the four applications available is there right mm -hmm. then after data management we already discussed data loader yeah yeah, right. yeah. this way analytics oh. analytics reports and dashboards we completed or not we did this we did this yeah, yeah. we come we completed reports so workflows and approval process also process we automation can... is nothing but what approval process approval right. process. Yeah. 
Okay. okay. Next user setup. So we already created a users. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. right. right. And then after what a good to know organization mm -hmm. setup means how to create a Salesforce account. Uh huh. Right. Yeah. Next uh -huh. activity management. Okay, we didn't discuss. Okay, desktop and mobile administration. We didn't discuss. Mm -hmm. Applic app exchange. We didn't discuss. Mm -hmm. Got it. See yeah. the one thing. One thing, Mukdam. See. <laughs> Certification yes, training is done. Yeah. Mm. What is this? This, this, this is a course, the curriculum or what? This is, this is a certification course. Right. Oh, okay. This yeah. is certification course, not a general training. Okay, so this is a Salesforce certification course. See, Mukda, certification course is different. Right. Mm. And next, uh, so normal training is different. No, no, no. Right. I'm fine with that, Shiva. I just mm. wanted to understand because when I saw these two things here, right? And I was like scratching my head. I'm like, <laughs> I don't know what did we do in this, you know? Right. Because right. everything else, I'm very sure because I did this hands on like standard objects, custom objects, right? Reports right. also did, data loader also I did, workflow, everything. But this two were like, you know, foreign to this me. Was, see, see. Just uh, you can go to, uh, you can go to login to Salesforce. I will show. I will show. See here, sales and marketing applications to directly say the what was the name? Sales and marketing application. Just you can log into Salesforce. I will show you. Okay, you have to clear, right? Yeah. Say marketing application free charge What what? Marketing marketing application marketing cloud. Are we clouds by yeah? Those hmm. are the clouds. Maybe these are the applications. Yeah, Mukda, log into your Salesforce here. Yeah, I'm I'm logging. Uh, okay, Shiva. See, just you can go to topmost right side. We're having a app menu is there, na? Topmost right. Yeah, content, oh. content, the blue color content available. Huh? Yeah, click on that. Uh -huh. See, then you can see here sales, service, marketing. Yeah. Better. These okay. are the applications. Sales, select the sales. Select uh -huh. the sales. Yeah. See, what are the objects we are having? Charter campaigns. Better. Uh -huh. So charter, see, charters are not coming to this one. That is separate one. See, campaigns, mm -hmm. leads, accounts, contacts, opportunities, forecast. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. contracts, orders. Okay, so next to products and uh, reports products up to this part only coming to the sales and right? uh -huh. what about reports and dashboards not coming to the sales and what was that uh, cases and solutions not coming to the sales and uh -huh. home and chart also not coming to the sales uh -huh. right okay. okay so we will ask for example lead just you can click on lead just you can click on lead lead uh, okay oh, right yeah okay so they will ask some one question okay how uh -huh. many ways to we create a lead Okay, mm -hmm. so is it possible to create a lead through the uh, website? Okay, uh -huh. so those type of questions they will ask. Those oh. type of questions they will ask. I see, I see. And what is Chatter, Shiva? A Chatter is nothing but for just communication purpose, like our Facebook. Chatter. Right? In Facebook also. In Facebook also, what we are doing, we are chatting. See, uh -huh. if you don't have the chatting concept, the chatting uh, a module in that uh, topics, no need to discuss. Okay. So this is what advanced has been or what? No, no, our regular. Two zero one. Uh huh. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Two zero. Yeah, two zero one certification. Uh huh. Yeah, Shiva. Okay, okay. So actually, we are getting the terms, but we are not seeing its course curriculum and everything, <laughs> right? Yeah, okay, so yeah. That's why I'm asking. Right, right, right. No problem. So I was, I like to be very like, you know, organized even even for your class. I'm taking notes right here uh, in a different uh, document here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, <laughs> so I'm, I'm always like taking notes and things like that. So I like to like, you know, set the things organized. So this was okay. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to study more on these because everything else and we are going to do security and access. Yeah, and and not, that, not that we started security and access. Okay, okay. in coming sessions, we'll see. Coming sessions, we'll see. Okay. Oh, no problem. Right. Anything else? Yeah, just yeah. you can scroll down, scroll down. 
what we're having agenda and like that like that uh, no no that was that was the training i was attending uh, i told you right the sales force right, right 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 mm -hmm. so then i so then i take my notes under the under the screens whatever they have you know mm -hmm. so yeah no problem Shall okay so i will meet tomorrow so please practice if you're having any doubts let me know okay madhu okay. madhu 10 o'clock we're yeah. having session okay yes sorry sorry yeah. <laughs> 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 discussion bye guys